We'll see. They do have one comfort pick. They do have Cadenza, Mr. Kenneth Castro on his Cupra. With yeah. So many K's and C's. Let's see how they can make this work. Early purple for both sides. Let's go to game number three. Yeah, that Kufra of Cadenza going into this game, actually undefeated. So, yeah, that is a uh, comfort pick the Blackness International needs to respect. Oh. No, ano para para to, ah? Lasty Jr. or uh, Chakno Jr. Another mm -hmm. catch type, another catch type uh, tank player in the making. Uh, I'm loving it. I hope so. I hope so. Kenneth Castro, alias Cadenza, sa Kufra. Starting it up, putting a line between the jungle on H2 and Venus, the queen themselves. Again, vision game. Let's talk about vision game here, Renmar. Who has it? Or wait, look at this. Ow! Pagkasapayata. Flicker already used up two minutes before he has that. And next week, of could use that to their advantage. Let's talk about yeah, vision uh, again. Ang uh, hirap uh -huh. para sa next play. They have to take everything honestly. Yeah, they do. Um... If Cadenza doesn't get to a shrub beforehand, Venus, we know, can just use first skill to check the shrubs, doesn't need to get anywhere close. Maybe keep the distance so that if ever I'm doing as Cadenza, he's going to Now, Vegeta Dito Fioreshi, Flicker Burned, Suplex City starting up and opening this bottom lane Lord Fiddle uh, up. And now Owl sharing the quad shadow and shadow kill combo with the. Two other members of Blacklist there. And just like that, nice juggle of top lane and bottom lane pressure by Blacklist. Oh, grabe! Humanic talaga yung mapa natin nung lumipa tayo dun sa top lane. <laughs> Ganun ka-option doon. And by the way, Leo, uh, it is the Edith XP lane na nilalaro ni Dominic for the first time here in the tournament. Yeah. Yeah. It's uh, uh, Suplex City, the XP lane dito. Answering a non-jungle paquito. So, 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 so there's a few unorthodox picks already or positioning for certain in-demand heroes in uh, this tournament so far. Already 1,000 gold lead, under 1,000 gold lead dito para sa blacklist. And Ureshi putting on some pressure here onto Dominic. There's the flip, the suplex, and look at this. Hayes, can he survive? Hindi na pipilitin dito ng blacklist international, but they are going to take this small creep camp. Yeah, 70 seconds uh, till the next turtle, so it's gonna be a long time. Blacklist International, very small gold lead, but next to Evos will be able to keep it close. And dami ng antique keras, so tignan mo, bumo ng antique keras. Ang Blacklist International, Dread, dreadnought. Ah, pa, classic dreadnought, sorry, yeah. dreadnought. Dreadnought Clash armor. Classic dreadnought. Yeah. Oh, no you way. get a dreadnought. Oh, you get a dreadnought. <laughs> <laughs> Yun yung prinaya nila. And this is gonna be making uh, gonna be difficult for it to cross into the mid to the late game para sa next play evos. And dami ng pang reduce ng physical attack ng NXP. And again, that's where uh, Mr. Bataanon here, Hayes, aka Apple Fisha, doon siya talaga kailangang mag ibig X Factor. So we'll see how this guy's gonna move. But so far, it's been difficult for him to make any breaks. Kaya nga ang bilis ng rotational speed ng uh, team ng Blackwood International given that they have a Rafaela to help with that holy healing. Kaya mo, back in again! Oh my god, oh. grabe yung dash! Pangulit! Ashtimikos Maximus on the Valentina. Uh, there's a punish right there. First blood drawn by Hayes. Yeah, and the unfortunate thing is, imbis na si... Ay, wait! Si Al? Oh, pero nakataka siya. Imbis na si Kagura yung nakapag last hit, which anyone who could have gotten the last hit is fine. At the end, si H2 pa rin, the high boost of the jungler got it dahil dun sa taking damage ng retribution niya. Yung damage over time, that secured the kill. So, I think Black Lizard Nash will be happy about that. Giving early kills to a Hayabusa is never a good thing. Yep, and oh, Cadenza catches out, stops that recall, and might even get the kill! Forces out the ult. Tira natin, mapipigilan ba ni Queen V? Ito, mahuli niya ba? Yes! That's going to be a kill on to Haji. Nabawi na yun. One for two plus eternal take by Wise. Hayes nag-aabang. Any birth down these two mages. Gonna jump in. Donut help finish. Down goes the Queen. And that's going to be Haji retreating. Next to Evos, they're finding their groove, Renmar. Two plus City on to our escaping Ureshi. Flicker to that wall. Plus that dash through. Buti na lang. Napaka-mobile na isang pakito. Wow. Seeing this matchup, of the roamers, Cadenza and Hayes, contra kay Haji at saka kay Oh My Venus. 
especially for Haji and Venus, and also for Hayes, three very experienced players. You're seeing it, and they're all just matching each other. Sa map rotation, sa pagsagot, sa mga uh, attempts at ganks ng kalaban nila. Owl, the fact that Cadenza was able to pressure him down, but then the response of Blacklist to go for it. Oh, watch Might out. another one here. Uh -huh, that's a 4v3 situation up top. Uh -huh, si Hayes. And uh, again, vision, rotation speed. Blacklist has it in spades. But so far, next play, was given this kill lead. Have found their windows. Right now, Pumukawa Matila for a 40 second turtle. Cadenza still standing up there. Oh, papasokin siya ni Kumay Venus. Hello. Spot it out. Vila Luna pushing away the tank. And Owl. Owl has done so well to survive, huh? given how many oh. times next play, was sent people to try and kill this Brody. He only has one death. But the pressure is sh slowly showing us. Slowly, nahihirapan na. Si Owl dito could not get a stun on the donut. Yeah. Kaya na force yung three man rotation doon. Or two man rotation for Blacklist International. Para matulungan si Owl. It's gonna be the Roamer and the Gold Laners together in one lane. So next play, Evos na amoy nila. Ang bottom lane mo kang bukas. Four gang. Duplex sitting here, starting it up. In comes Wise. Owl gonna go down first. Off camera kill. Mapa push ni Donut yon. Villa Luna. Put about half health. Cannot be finished off by Cadenza. But still 100%. Third will take Craig Tito para to Blacklist International. H2 not gonna force it. A longer retreat. Nice. Turtle goes to Blacklist International. NXPE. It really looked like they could have taken down Dominic. But then it was Blacklist International na rotate sila sa tamang oras at nahuli nila ang Paquito. Next play, Evos. And with all those stacking together, the fact that Paquito went down, um, not enough, meron pang umiikot galing sa next play, Evos. At the top lane, of course, nabasag nila yung Taurus sa top lane. It was an open tur uh, turtle para sa Blacklist. So far, last turtle na yon. It's gonna turn into a lord now, about a minute and a half away. Donut picking up here the Berserker's Fury. It's a good game for Donut, gotta say. Uh, ang ganda na recovery ng batang ito coming in from uh, difficult two games so far in the series. In control ang Clint. Yeah, and the, the thing is though, for the lineup for next play Evos, they really have to give a lot of space for this Clint. It, there'll be a lot of trades na mangyari every team fight. But if next play Evos can just keep their uh, their gold laner is safe, their clean safe. Para makapag free hit the back line, they'll, they'll be able to do just that. But Cadenza, kailangan niya na pin talaga si Wise, because Wise will be doing everything he can to get to the back line para mahuli si Donut. Mm -hmm. And uh, once he does get a bead on the clean, yon okay na. Pero so far, next play was doing great to protect this clean. And minsan uh, lumalam ng sila again, very small lead. Wait lang, H2. Magisa dito. He wise. Kasama na sa ni Dominic. Gonna help clear this wave. Bottom lane. That's a turn apart memory. Onto Cadenza. That's a few stacks. Pero hindi lang ipa tapos. Flame shots. Simulan na dito ni Hayes. That's gonna be a concealed play by Cadenza. No targets to be found. Bouncing ball out. It's gonna be one of those games where one big play, isang malaking team fight, could determine who will control up to the late game. First Lord has spawned, and now, oh, next PE, Blacklist, a very, very close game. Blacklist, hinahanap pa rin nila yung opening nila para makabasag ng Tore. Even if Donut had a good game, Owl, despite the two early deaths, Blacklist, ginagawa nila lahat para makahabol yung Brody nila sa farm, which they will need at this point. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Again, next play, was having a very melee, heavy lineup. Mas maganda yung mga torn apart memory, pero kaya nalang i-time out, eh, i-time well yung paglagay ng stack. And that's our putting some on. Starting it early, another push by next play Evos, and a failed engage. Cannot gonna be able to kill Oreshi. Did I speak too soon? Hayes putting up the boundary, protecting his XP laner. Ang ganda na push sa baba. That's going to be a stuplex plus an ult here by Dominic. Mapapatay niya ba si Cadenza? Here we go, Flicker use already! Oh! And another! Flicker in plus a suplex! Cannot finish the job! Cannot take down Donut! Dominic, your sacrifice is appreciated! Blacks International securing the Lord, trading out their XP laner's lives! has been destroyed! That was just wild! By Dominic, Flicker, Cyclone Eye, para mo connect yung 
second skill throw Red niya. What a play, but slain. definitely. Oh, na patumban ni Owl si Oreshi. Mm -hmm. <laughs> International with the Lord. Wow, NXT have to defend this. Ang ginawa ni Domito para 10 hit combo. Ang dami ng ginawa, ang dami ng kinain. Sunod, sunod. Yung ulti, yung range para ma-burst yung Kufra, tas balik sa kay Phyla. <laughs> oh, look at this! Did they try to bait it out? Might have been too much. Gil card, oh my Venus! Trying to fake out one! Rise finally shut down Donut, but it's a trade! Three man collapse yet tayo! And Hayes goes down to Owl! That's gonna be a two for one trade, plus a turtle! Oh, and a turret, I'm sorry! No more turtles in this game! That is a great trade for Black Wizard International Quad Shadow Shadow Kill. Combo taken in, but how he still get? Can't force along it out. Asan? Oto Oreshi. Tapos sa ito pa kita na to. That's a knockout. Four for one in the long run. Black Wizard International back in the driver's seat. Nakakapag trade ang next play Evos. Nakakapag trade sila sa kills. The gold is very close. In terms of the item builds, the jungler is not too far from each other. My lapid on the farm, nila wise at H2. But right now, NXP Evos is just getting outplayed by Blacklist International. Wala na yung Torres sa gitna. At mas mahirap na ang NXP Evos dito. Kasi baka may chance na Blacklist International pumasa sa jungle nila. Supresahin sila. They might be contesting this purple buff of H2 a little bit more. Let's see. Another deep cut here in real time, by the way. Instant replay, like we play, yung magandang trade ng Blacklist International. But in real time, medyo mas may confidence ang Blacklist. Medyo ay na lang ulit pilitin ang next play Evos into these less than favorable situations. Again, because of just the nature of their build, their composition here. So far, 37k to 34. 3k gold lead in 12 minutes. 30 seconds to the next lord. But it's not even made of Blacklist International for the top lane. Look, H2 is just managing that. Yeah. The key here for Blacklist is at least they got the mid lane. The Torre is in the mid, they're still there. But three, they're in the middle. So we're going to get two of them. Oh, River Bush here. Close call here. If they're in the middle, it's probably. Yung uh, Edith, kung nandun si Dominic, could have been a great engagement, pero naka-man-to-man defense si Koresh doon. Now rotating up into mid lane. Blacks National has Lord Priority. Baka ulitin ni Dominic yun, ha? yung 10 hit combo niya. To sacrifice himself oh. for this luminous Lord. Could be worth it still. He did it once kanina, ngayon worth it pa rin yun, Dominic. Wow, look. A beacon. Threat magnet. Oh, next play, Evos. They sent Oreshi to the bottom lane. Tignan natin. Sino mo kung anong Lord na to? He's doing it again! Benmar! Dominus by time again! Or oh, na kuha na nga si H2. Still a trade oh, and Donut gonna go down here. Pero wait lang, ma-inhibitor yata, mapapush yata ang Blacks International. Oh, that's, that's worth it! Next play Evos! They found their trade, they found their window! Now Haji walking into Oreshi here. Not gonna get the kill, but so far so good! Next play Evos! They made lemo lemonade out of lemons! Sneaky play galing sa NXPE. Binigay na nila yung Lord para sa Blacklist International. Pero, wala nila kunin yung inhibitor! Oh no! That's Owl taken down by Oreshi. Mabubuhay pa ba si Hayes? The answer is yes. Oh, that's going to be the Kagura. Still standing. Oreshi in Hubble dito. Not for long. Haji traded out. One for one. Lord still standing. There's a nice wave going up top. Bottom lane, mapupush yan itong manage ni Dominic. And so far, we're at parity one more time. Not close yung gap. Next to Evo's only behind about 2k. Yeah, evening things out. The pick off nila si Al. And they were able to... Next to Evo's, nasupress nila ang Blacklist International sa mid lane. Pero mukhang Blacklist makakakuha pa ng Torre dun sa taas. So clean up crew. This is just Blacklist doing housekeeping. Pati bottom lane yata. Unless H2 can say something about it. Nope, too late. Could be the wraparound. Look at this! Oh! Nas patan siya. And that's gonna be the knock-up here in the bottom lane. Quad Shadow out. Na naka-out siya ng purple. Wow! Ang bilis! Plowing through the jungle. Blacklist International. Yeah, and this is what we were saying earlier. They wanna take away that purple buffer H2. But sabihin ko lang ha, for a moment there, nung nag-dash si Dominic, kala ko yung sa sobrang layo na 
napuntahan ni Ace. Akala ko nabato pala ni Dominic. Hindi pala Shadow Clone yung nag-teleport lang siya sa Shadow Clone niya. Pero mukhang binato ni Dominic sa sobrang layo. <laughs> Ibang klaseng suplex. <laughs> oh, <laughs> approved na yun eh. Yeah, pero let's, let's talk about how H2 again still has a solid placing despite this difficult situation. His Hayabusa is doing it best. 3-1 and 2. Now look at the items. He's one more away from a full arsenal. Yeah, it's, it's not a kill-heavy game. Both teams really... Lahat ng focus nila on the objectives. He already has the Blade of Despair on the way to the last item. Almost fully built. Same thing goes for Wise. And now, Blacklist. Trying to consider then yung next play tactic talaga na split push. Oy, oh, you play? Oh, no. That's going to be an engagement. They not need force. They're gonna walk into Cadenza. Oh, stretching. Kino mahuli dito ni Kenneth Castro. No one. That's a false engage. Neither team was in favor there. Okay na rin yun for both teams. Alam nila, may Lord Monk spawn and it is up again. Ah, uh, I love the adjustment of the respawn timer of Lord. Parang bumilis talaga yung laro. <laughs> Alright, yes. Nanakaw pa yung Lord! This two fries on another level! Malalasti mo magnakaw! <laughs> Dapat ano na yun? Dapat magandang ano, start na yun para sa Blacklist International. Dalawang kills dun sa bottom lane. Or actually, uh, I think it could have been three kills at the bottom lane. They already had the Lord, pero si Kadenza hindi pumitaw sa Lord. Makiklear lang ko ng Blacklist ah. International though. Pero... Tignan mo yung wave states, Leo. So many waves getting close uh, to the base of NXPE. Renmar, hindi lang si H tong melahe. If you know, you know. Si Cadenza, binigyan niya rin. Tinuruan niya ng Jutsu. What? Oh, man. Piling ko yun nga yung That's taking great. damage ng Cursed Helm niya eh. Yes, or... or uh, also, kano bin concussive blast? Or, or a basic oh, attack? Baka. I don't know. Oh. Wow. That, that, that single-handedly put next to Evos back in a way where they can defend. Honestly, putas dapat yung bottom lane nila pero dahil na naaw ni Cadenza, nahirapan panalo, nag-buy time para pigilan yung blacklist. Amazing! Uh, really ko yung blacklist kung nakuha nila yung Lord dun, kalbo na yung base dito na next play Evos. Eh. Wala na ka inhibitor turret dyan. And... Because of that Lord Steel, it was saved for NXPE. But don't get us wrong, Blacklist International, comfortable pa sila sa control nila sa mapa. It's a 4K gold lead. It's a one item lead. Conceal movement, but NXPE, they're being careful. But no! Oh! There's a flicker in. Misses the Holy Baptism. Cadenza gonna go for the counter initiation stretching. Cancel Muna. Goes for a conceal play himself. And they disengage. So, bilangan tayo. Bilangan ng battle spell. Bilangan ng skill. And so far, no one is committing this game. Uh, I love the discipline both of these two teams are showing. Naghihintay talaga sila ng opening ng mahanap nila. And now with this Lord up here, both teams right now, titignan lang talaga nila yung mga minion waves, shove something, maybe force one out. And looks like that's the plan for next play, Evos. Pero makita to ni Dominic. And Dominic still playing the, uh, the odd man role. Siyang nagbabay time, siyang nagdi-distract. And look at this, papatukin siya ni Del Rosario. This is very dangerous for this Karina. But the rest of Next Play Evo is disengaging. It seems like they have a plan. Mupapahabol ba siya? Oh, the There's a suplex. There's the knock-up. Pero na-dash out. Na-flicker and out. Ni Ureshi. And they're still continuing. Oh no, though, that's looking low. And they disengage. Nag-ahabolan sila. Parang Tom and Jerry. Oh. <laughs> oh, the NXPE. Good call to back off there. Kung nag-engage dun sila, Hirap pa uh, manalo sa scenario na yon. You have members of Blacklist International coming from everywhere. Actually, si Haji took the long way around. He, parang pangatlo, pangapat na best ko na nakita yun na tatakbo ang NXPE. And Haji will always be the one to try and cover the escape route. Yeah. And right now, they may have found the beat out to H2. Can't finish the job. 
that's going to be oh. age two retreating. And ngayon, bilang nila na malayo. John falls along that. Tatlo dito, mas duplex ang isa. There's an Akap as well. Kadenza, not gonna be long for this world. Immortality pop. Tatapos mo nila. The answer is yes. Owl gets the finish onto the Kufra. Kulang yata sila dito ng contest power. Pero wait lang, may masasabi pa yata dito. PH2, Chapo, Salonga. The back open the steel. Hindi mo ulit. Not twice. Immortality pop here. On a two wise. There's gonna be two kills down. For the title, Blacklist International. Magu Boy Barrett 3. Sabi ni Oh My Venus Owl. And be the only ones left. There is a Lord. It looks like it's Deja Vu, pero baliktad. Tickling mo naman ang asalob ng base ngayon ng Blacklist. Very bad for Blacklist International. What a counter punish by next play Evos. May minion wave sila sa gitna. Tignan natin kung makilir ka ng Blacklist. And it's just V and Owl. Oh! And there's the old kick pop. And that's the immortality as well. Could this be the white box? Shadow kill. Ladies and gentlemen, next play Evos is on the board. We're looking at a score of two and one. Wow, next play Evos. Hindi sila mamamatch point ngayon. 2-1 already. What a game by both teams. But most of the game, it was safe to say it was a blackness game. The control that they found, the tempo that they had, the tower pushes that they had already. Even though at one point, next play Evos were leading in the tower pushes, nakuha nila yung mga Lord. But game-changing moment talaga yung si Cadenza. The fact that nakuha niya yung Lord, we don't know how. But he still got it away from Wise. Kenneth Castro saving the game for NXP. Pero pagkatapos nun, of course, la marami pang ginawa ng next play Evos para makapunta sila sa panalo. Donut keeping his distance, really trying to stay safe in the team fights, And the call for NXP to chase the members of Blacklist International. Pagkatapos nakuha ng Blacklist yung Lord, hinabol na sila ng NXP. Yung ginawa ng NXP, it's like something that Blacklist International would do. Na magkokotest ng Lord, hindi nila makuha na Lord, punish it, and it worked out perfectly for NXP kasi meron nga silang minion waves dumadaan papunta galing sa bottom lane and sa mid lane.